It's Thursday morning, March 11th, and I just got out of another American Airlines swing trade, ticker AAL. And as you can see here, I played it off of a green daily, and this gapping pattern just won't quit, guys. To show you on the minute chart here, you can see that my entry was at the close yesterday, getting in at around 21.75. My exit was this pre-market. I got out around 7 a.m. before this big drop, getting out at mostly $22 a share. You can see that on the monitor, I got out with 90% of my shares at $22 a share and 10% of them about at 21.9, which in cash was around $2,400. So not too bad considering that I got about 1.15% on that swing trade. So pretty good swing trade there. And to show you back on the daily, I've been explaining this with my last few videos and you can see why this green gapping pattern off of the green dailies here has been so consistent that the last time it's failed has been all the way back on the 17th of February. So the fact that this gapping pattern has been that consistent and holding throughout pretty much almost a whole month now, I've, I'd be foolish not to keep holding this, you know, not to keep playing this off the green days. So to show you also the indexes, it was smart to stick with American Airlines because the Dow Jones right here, you can see it was going higher and showing good upwards momentum. S&P was kind of like the middle between the two, the the NASDAQ and the Dow Jones was okay but that the NASDAQ which is important to watch you can see was on a downtrend has been pulling back and yesterday even though it gapped up pulled back again so I kind of feel safer to stick with the the Dow Jones stock instead of the NASDAQ stock and you can see here on my swing trading watch list visuals these are the NASDAQ stocks right in infotech some consumer discretionary and communication services while the Dow Jones stocks, finance, industrials, you know, energy, consumer staples, healthcare, those have been sticking in the green. So it's smart to stick with these Dow Jones stocks at the moment since that's what's leading. And yeah, if you if you like these stocks to swing trade and you see that they're, you know, high volume blue chip stocks, not low risk stocks or high risk stocks, just follow along and I'll keep showing you what I do. Don't forget to join the Sleep Easy Trades Discord server. This is now where I'm going to be offering all of my swing trades and swing trading advice. You can find the link in the description below.